So settle back and enjoy baseball tonight from Florida Ballpark. 3-2 pitch. Popped it up. Center fielder charging in. Can't make a play. Webb gave it a try, but it's going to be a two-base hit for Judd Fabian on a blooper into shallow center field. Sterling Thompson, the hitter, drives one deep to center field. Webb going back and back, and he makes a sensational catch at the fence, robbing Thompson of a two-run home run. A sacrifice fly brings in Fabian. Another out on the ledger. There's ball driven deep into right field by Wyatt Langford, and this one is gone. Langford lofts one up into that gale force wind. A solo home run, and it is two to nothing. Yeah. Not close. Fabian gets an RBI as Smith walks in Calilau. It is three to nothing. That ball hit the right center field with pretty good travel. Way back and back, and it is caught by Webb at the wall. Another run comes in as Rivera has scored. And it is four to nothing as Halter drives home his 14th run of the year. Pitches. Fly ball, right center field. With some carry, and it is gone. Ryapel pokes one over the fence in right center field beyond the 380 foot marker, and it is five to nothing. That ball is slapped to left. That will get in for a base hit. Here comes the throw to third. He's there. And Arkansas is going to run to second base, and they're going to score as the ball gets away. So the Gators failed to execute, and it's now 5-1. to one. That smashed past Wallace at third. Thompson digging for third. He'll come across. And on the throw to third, Langford heads up, cruises into second base. This one is popped into left field. Borfin takes the measure of it. Runner at third tags. Thompson coming home. Here's the runner going to third. Nobody covering the bag. And the Gators get a run and move Langford over to third base. And now it's six to one. There's a line drive. That's going to be extra bases. Langford scoring. Callalau cruising in with a stand-up double. Well, it's hard to stay back sometimes without pulling a hanging slider and going for the next two days. Ball struck well. Fabian turns his back to the plate, goes way back, hits off the wall at 400 feet. Webb comes around third. Slavens will walk in with a triple. And it's 7-2. to two. Grinnell trying to go the final three and a third. And there's the ground ball to Halter. And this game is all over. And the first pitch of the game at 102 Eastern time. To make. And there's a base hit to right. No doubt about that line drive. There's a line drive base hit into center field. Halter makes the turn, coming for three. And the throw, he's in there. And Thompson takes second base. Yeah, missed the cutoff, man. And Thompson, smart player that he is, took advantage. Ground ball going to get a run in. Moore playing on the shortstop side of the bag. Safe at first base. Langford let it out. Of course he did. Nobody runs harder down the line in college baseball than Wyatt Langford. There goes the runner. The pitch driven into center field. Webb is going back and back, and it is gone! Oh, my! Ryapel poked one out of the ballpark. In right center field, a ball that went about 400 feet.
I told you what BT stands for. Big time. Five strikeouts. That's a leadoff base hit to center field for Robert Moore on a 1-2 pinch. That's a line drive to right. Will fall in front of Thompson. That's a base hit into left. Moore being waved in. The throw cut off. And it's now 4-1. On an RBI base hit for Battles, driving in his 20th run of the year. Fly ball hit toward right field. And it's going to fall in for a base hit. And with the runners moving, they're all going to score. And the Razorbacks have tied the game on Gregory's three and two, two out, three run double to right field. Fabian leading off the home fifth inning. Goes after the first breaking ball on a pop fly to right. Could be some trouble. And in the triangle, it falls for a base hit. There's a little opposite field. Shot to left. That flare falls in. And the Gators have runners at first and second. That pitch drilled out to center field. Way back. And back. And it is gone. Wyatt Langford lofts one into the Disney Grove. And the Gators lead 7-4. Mississippi State. And it ball is off. Cal allowing a foul territory. Here comes Battles in to score. And a tough day at first base for Cal Allow. He scored that in air. Bullpen. Can't find the plate. Walks in a run. It's seven to six. Strikes. And he got him swinging. Big strikeout. First later as in the bullpen. And the fly ball hit to right field. You can forget about it. This ball is long gone, and Gregory has done it again. And this game is tied again. 7-7. And four RBIs today for the nine-hole hitter. Hitter for the season. Showing bunt. Got a high pitch. Laid it down. And the throw is errant. And here's Rivera going for an extra base. That's a bunt single and a throwing error. Oh, a beautiful bunt. How about that? Great. Bunt by Gassetti. He'll get a glad hand all around that dugout. There it is. A drive into center field. Going to be caught. A late jump by Rivera. The throw to the plate. He's safe. And the Gators take the lead. Back to the bag. And there's a ball hit down the line. That'll be rattling around into the corner. Halter headed for second with a walk-in double. First pitch smashed past Wallace in the left field. Here comes Halter. He'll score. That was a Fabian rocket shot off Wallace. And it's now 9-7. And an error. Fly ball out to center field. Braden Webb. There to make the catch. Fly ball hit the shallow left. Langford coming in and the ball game is over. And the Florida Gators have done it the hard way coming through the back door. Getting two runs in the bottom of the eighth inning and beat the Arkansas Razorbacks nine to seven.